Hello everyone and welcome to Learning User. Today we are going to be solving multiplication word problems. In a classroom, there are five rows with eight chairs in each row. In each row. How many chairs are there in the classroom? First, highlight all the numbers in the problem. Five and eight are the only numbers in the problem. And then start writing the numbers. I know five times eight is 40. So 40 is the answer. Dave is arranging tiles for his office room. There are seven rows with eight tiles in each row. How many tiles did they use for his office room? Since we know there are seven rows with eight tiles in each row, we're going to need to do seven times eight, which is 56. So Dave used 56 tiles for his office room. Rosie has four stacks of cards with six cards in each stack. How many cards are there in all? Here we have four stacks with one, two, three, four, five, six cards in each stack. So we do four times six, which is 24. So 24 is the answer. Tanya bought nine pack of apples. Each pack has five apples. How many apples did Tanya buy in all? Here we have nine packets of apples and five apples in each row. So we do nine times five, which is 45. So 45 is the amount of apples Tanya bought in all. Justin bought four boxes of pencils. Each pencil box contains 12 pencils. How many pencils did Justin buy in all? So step one, we highlight all the numbers in the problem, which is 12 and four. And since we know we are doing multiplication word problems, we put seven, I mean, four times 12. So first we can do call multiplication. Since I know four times two is eight and four times one is four, the answer is 48. You can also do it another way. Since we all know four times 10 equals 40, four times 11 equals 44, and four times 12 equals 48. So the answer for this problem is 48. Thanks for watching. Write your comments in the comment box below. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and click the bell button.